Allow me to ask you one question, sir. Do you know that God loves you? Other damages due to extraordinary weather conditions will be deemed acts of God and not covered under said policy. Acts of God? All right, God, here I am in your house. And I want to know, did you destroy my house? And what if he did? Then God should pay for it, should pay for it! body of Christ. Bishop Bernardo Rossini. Yes, my son. You've been served. You're suing someone in a court of law. You're suing God. Congratulations, Miss Levin. You are now officially God's law. You ready to tangle with the big guy? Let's do this, Hefe. I'd just like to say that I'm looking forward to a good, clean fight. I know that God is a tough and formidable opponent, but I think I can take him, huh? Do you even believe in God, Mr. Frank? Why? What'd he tell you? Sorry, it's attorney client privilege. Proof of the existence of God is all around us, if we choose to see it. No evidence. You people, always looking for someone to blame. Us people? Lawyers. So you can deny God and still be a Jew? Well. Maybe not really a Jew, but Jewish. Mazel tov! This clown's turning my courtroom into a circus. He done the wrath, he can do the math. I don't have any answers. Only questions. Lots of questions. The question is, how can you blame God when you don't even believe that he exists? I'm sorry, but bad things happen to good people, good things happen to bad people, and horrible things happen to innocent people. And I don't know how to find any meaning in it. Fighting with God isn't gonna bring her back. This is the big truth, man. He knows everything, he can do anything, he is everywhere. And I reserve the right to call God to the stand. Can I get a witness? Yeah. Hallelujah!